It's 654 time for the morning sprint. Back to that report of a motorcycle and bus colliding in Wanakee. That call came in less than a half an hour ago. It happened at the intersection of Nord Drive and Ramish Road. No word on if there are any injuries. That is something we're working right now to figure out. We do have a crew on the way to the scene. We'll provide updates in our news breaks. Americans will finally see some relief when it comes to interest rates. The Federal Reserve has cut interest rates for the first time in four years. The standard rate is now down half a percentage point. That's twice the usual deduction of a quarter percent. Rates have been at a 23-year high for more than a year. There could still be more cuts this year. People in Richland County will get to ask questions of county officials about last year's data hack. The county board is holding a special meeting next Tuesday at 6. The event will begin with a discussion about roles and responsibility in county government. And attendees will eventually be able to ask questions about anything, including the data breach. People in Dane County can expect to pay more in property taxes. That's because of the county's new budget proposal. There's nearly a 50% decrease in this year's capital plan. The average Madison home will see taxes raised by $17 in taxes, roughly. The proposal totals more than $903 million. One of the two teenage prisoners charged with the death of a prison counselor will stand trial. A judge found enough evidence for 17-year-old Ryan Nyblon to go to trial. The Lincoln County District Attorney is charging Nyblon with being a party to felony murder battery. It's from an incident at the Lincoln Hills Copper Lake School. Nyblon is due in court today. And some drinkers say they wouldn't mind a nutritional label with their beverage. Researchers in the UK say calorie labels on their alcohol would make them change their habits. In particular, it would help them maintain a healthier weight. Calorie labels are not currently required in the UK. We finally have a chance of rain and some thunderstorms, some of which could be strong to severe, mainly west of Madison in the forecast this evening into tonight. That will affect the early morning hours of Friday, probably making its way to Madison between 1 and 2 a.m. overnight. Night. Another chance of rain then Saturday evening night into Sunday. We stick with off and on rain chances through that Monday Tuesday time frame. So squeezing out some much needed rain finally. Do you think we'll get quite a bit? Uh, maybe like an inch and a inch inch and a half over that span. So not okay. a lot but anything as well. Yeah we'll take it. Point. Yeah. Thanks Savannah. Thanks for watching. We'll have another news and weather update in a half an hour.